We spoke to running back Kenny McIntosh. Listen to this. The coolest moment you see me out there with the camera? It wasn't the one, one of these cameras. I'm talking about the one you out there turning around like, in the end zone like that. Huh? That was one of my favorite moments right there. I was able to capture everybody's reaction. I don't think they was able to see me, but I was zooming in to everybody's reaction. People doing snow angels out there, my fault. But, um, you know, every moment is, you know, prepare, be preparing for this game. I'm going to remember my, my last time. Every, everybody walking up to me saying, man, this is the last one. This is the last dance. So I'm just missing the team. This, um, this group of men, man. Uh, it's special. So, what, do, what do these guys mean to you? You say this. What does this group mean to you? Everything, man. You know, we had a young group come in, and they, they, all of them took their role serious, and they 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 learned from last year's team. You know what I'm saying? Because for us to go to where we went last year and to do it again, it had to take nothing but guys that that's gonna buy in and it rose listening. Um, being connected, not not complaining or anything like that. So these young group of guys came in and you know executed that and did what they had to do to make this team better for the you know older cats. And, and Kirby always preached like the team goal is more important than the individual goal. The individual goal is gonna come once the team be successful. So you know all the guys bought into that and that's what we did this year. You guys made it look easy tonight, but how hard is it to go back to back? It's hard, man. I ain't gonna lie to you, especially in the SEC. Like I said, any week you can go out there and, and, and you know. I don't want cursing nothing like that, but get your, your behind beat, you know what I'm saying? So um, you just got to be prepared and, you know, go out there with a chip and you'll make it personal. The more you're making it personal, can it win three? Did again? Can it win three? They put their mind to it. You're in Hollywood. We already see you're starting to celebrate. <laughs> How do you celebrate tonight? Beginning. Y'all ain't seen nothing yet. This is the beginning, <laughs> y'all. Jordan, what's up, my boy? Jordan Fowler, what up, boy? Appreciate it, Hope. But no, um, <laughs> what's your question again? <laughs> <laughs> How's the celebration gonna go? I'm gonna be lit. <laughs> yeah, man. Y'all gonna see, but I don't know about y'all, but y'all gonna see. I'm be lit. You feel me? My last one with these guys, man. I just wanna enjoy the moment. Like you said, we in LA. Um, you feel me? We finna be lit. I don't know what that's gonna be, man. We'll have to watch the Instagram live. I ain't gonna be on Instagram live. <laughs> <laughs> Probably for the best. Kenny, we're the. We're the Oh my gosh, do you think his hat is big enough? <laughs> he could fill the hat after tonight's game. Do, oh, you think, yeah. do you think the stogie was big enough? Oh my God, there was a lot going on there, but, but what he had to say was nice too. He talked a lot about the cohesiveness of the group, which is something yeah. that Stetson Bennett talked about during the news conference and talk, it, talked about what a special group of guys this really was and how tightly knit they all are. They even got a little emotional there and the love was certainly on display on the field tonight as UGA crushed TCU. Our team